Finally, a parking space. However, for many, the challenge has just begun. How do I get the car into the space? And he has solved this problem because he has the parking formula in his head. And not only there, Jörg Grüne has found the application which perfectly implements the formula. The goal is for me to maneuver into the parking space as quickly as possible. Now, when you're sitting in the car, the question is, when do I start to turn the wheel? Which angle do I take in order to optimally park the car? And we have addressed precisely this problem using a formula, which is integrated into the system so that the entire vehicle takes over the steering, and thus a large part of the effort for the driver in order to unerringly park in the parking space. And this is how the system functions in practice. When driving, ultrasound sensors search the roadside for a parking space. Once one is found, an arrow is displayed on the instrument panel. Pressing a button starts the parking procedure. The driver still needs to use the throttle and brakes, yet does not have to steer. If the driver comes too close to other vehicles, he receives a warning. Done. The parking procedure is finished. A total of 10 sensors are built into the vehicle, although only two sensors, one at the front left and the other at the front right, are responsible for measuring the parking space. You can imagine the sensors like a bat which works with sonar. The sensors emit sonar waves, the ultrasound is reflected, comes back, and the sensors and the control unit evaluate the time and thus calculate the path. This ultimately enables me to assess the depth of the parking space. Gröner worked on the project at the Technology Center in Sindelfingen. Here he developed the formula for the parking process. The next task was to transform the complex mathematical formula into a small white box. All of the major components are integrated into this box to operate all of the sensors and ultimately implement the functions and display them to the customer. At the beginning of the development phase, we actually needed three computers to run the entire system. In the course of more than three years of development, we succeeded in making the whole system small enough to actually fit it into the vehicle in terms of both the costs and naturally the space. Now for the test. At the proving ground, Mr. Gröner shows just what the parking assistant can truly do. The parking space is extremely small. We time the process. For so little space, the system requires three maneuvers instead of usually two or even one. Nevertheless, the car is comfortably and safely parked in only 19 seconds. Everyone who wants to be free of parking maneuvers now finds the parking assistant in the A and B classes from Mercedes-Benz.